it's uh, 645 or so and I think I'm gonna move my meditations to nighttime because the morning's here uh, well I've been out for a little while but planning my day uh, but the mornings here are a little bit crazy and there's someone in this house that as soon as I breathe the breath of I'm awake they wake up as well say hi I'm going to be getting ready because <clears throat> I have to MC tonight for this event for the nonprofit organization that I'm involved with. And um, basically, that's what's happening today. So I have to go. I have my dress. I have my shoes. I have to go shopping. I have to get my nails done. And God help us all. <laughs> I have to do my own makeup. So we'll see what. Yeah. <laughs> We'll see what happens. You're shaking. Let me see. Let me see. Like. <laughs> That's funny. That's funny. Let me see when you shake. Let me see. Uh... <laughs> Okay, so yeah, done, and then I got a petty, which I'm gonna show you guys later. And then I went and I got makeup, and guys, I mean, seriously, why are we doing this to ourselves? There was stuff there, I don't even know what it's, what are you doing? What are you, what, are you, what is that? What is that? There is stuff that I don't even know what it's for, like, what was that? Highlight, highlight, why do you need to highlight anything? like your cheek and this one over here that look look that's you open your mouth open your mouth that looks funny i don't want to look at the cloud oh that looks cute yeah okay so that's done i'm gonna go change the clutch because while i was doing my nails and getting a really nice back massage I thought about it again and I don't like the one I got so I'm getting another one by the way I got my eyebrows done look at this you guys you know that lady she seems like she was enjoying my pain way too look at this look what that's like eyebrow action you guys yes that's sexy. final result you guys I love them they look great. Um, boogers. That's not boogers, that's jello. Why do you say that's boogers? Tati told me these are boogers. Tati told you they're boogers? Tati! Bella says you told her that jello is boogers. Ew. No, it's not, Bella. Yes, it is. No, it's not. Yes, it Bell is. Bella, mm -hmm. that's jello. It's not boogers, okay? Who needs so much makeup? Like, seriously. And I think this is just like the tip of the iceberg here. Like, if I wear all this makeup, I would probably be afraid to even get near a water heater. Seriously. Because, holy crap, all the chemicals and everything. joining in our celebration and for your contribution this evening, the Global Village Impacts Free Senior Food Distribution Program, which is where your generous daughters this evening will go to. So for that, we and the community, thank you. My name is Ingrid Jackson. Tonight we celebrate several accomplishments by several outstanding individuals. First and foremost, we honor a man who has been rightfully recognized by the media, his community, and his peers as a leader and a role model. He served in law enforcement for 28 years as a deputy sheriff here in Broward County. Due to what he saw during his career, he realized that there was a need for someone in the community to reach out and help individuals who were less fortunate and also helped those who had broken the law 
and we're in need of not only redemption, but we're also in desperate need of something that they perhaps never had. And that was someone who truly believed in them. Someone who saw their capabilities and was willing to give them a second chance. A chance that perhaps they wouldn't have otherwise gotten. In the 1990s, he started a program within the criminal justice system and Hope Restored was born. There, he gave individuals a chance for a do-over. See, many of them graduate the program and even receive their GEDs from behind bars. Some of these individuals later became law-abiding citizens and productive members of society some of whom we will honor this evening as well. This extraordinary man has a four-year Bachelor's of Science degree in criminal justice, in addition to two master's degrees, one in school guidance and the other in mental health and counseling. Today, as he has recently received a doctorate in philosophy, we have gathered and are proud to celebrate the lifetime achievements of Dr. Basil T. Phillips, Sr.